thumb makes up the cari lobe. Your knuckles here separate the liver and the horizontal plane where the portal vein lies separating superior from inferior. And then you have these three digit lines that are the hepatic veins, left hepatic vein, middle hepatic vein, and right hepatic vein. So it would be thumb cari lobe, segment two, three, four A, four B, five, six, seven, and eight. So now let's look at some ultrasound views, beginning with sagittal. All right, so you got your probe there on segments two and three. All right, so here you have your aorta, superior segment two and inferior segment three in sagittal. Moving more laterally, you have your IVC, segment one, again, segment three and segment two. So segment one is caudate lobe. Moving to segments four. All right, you have a little bit of gallbladder right there. And here's your portal vein plane. Segment four B, A, five, eight, and seven. Moving further laterally. Start to get a little bit of kidney right here. So five, eight, six and seven and then all the way laterally there you have your kidney and segments five six seven and eight now one thing to keep in mind is with ultrasound you're scanning the liver in angles that you might not be able to get in CT as a CT you're getting perfect transverse images the patient's positioned correctly and perfect sagittal images and within a uh, ultrasound you you can be angling subcostally intracostally using oblique angles to get better pictures with so that's why you're going to be having several segments in one picture and you'll see that now when we do the transverse images okay all right so in transverse so that's the superior segments Superior segment of the liver, segment two. Okay, and you'll see you have, you see you have, and you see you have two, four A and eight. We're in the superior segment, so we're scanning around this region right here. So two, four A and eight. Okay, now we're angling from inferior to superior. So here you're gonna have the portal vein branch feeding segment three, the portal vein, vein branch feeding segment two, the cauda lobe here, segment one, segment four B, and segment five. So we're kind of like right here, angling upwards. So closer to the transducer face are gonna be the inferior segments of the liver. So three, four B. And then as you go more posteriorly, you'll start getting two and five, as well as the cauda lobe, which is behind here. Okay, now we're gonna approach from inferior to superior. There you can see the pancreas. All right, angling upwards. Here we have three, cauda lobe, segment five and four B. So we're, we're around this region right here. Okay, now scanning on the right lobe of the liver. Here we start transverse. We've got your gallbladder, segment four B, five and six. So we'll be right here, four B, five and six. And now scanning the superior segment of the right lobe and transverse. There you have your hepatic veins. Okay, so here you have 4A, 8, and 7. So you're scanning around right here. And you'll see that your middle hepatic vein separates 4A from 8, and your right hepatic vein separates 8 from segment 7.